Okay, greetings everyone. We're fucking back. And, uh, <laughs> we're back. And, uh, I've got the handsome and sexy Mr. Christopher Baird with me, as usual. Oh, hello. Oh, hello, hello. Oh, hello everybody. Yeah, you see, you can uh, look forward to more of that. <laughs> voices. <laughs> Stupid voices. Stupid voices from the north. Or something. Over, the top, uh, over the top of a... Well, it's probably a very serious story yeah. about, uh things that you can't mention on YouTube because we've been forced into using um, childish language. Let's give this this one a look. This is apparently some kind of mystery game. Uh, and uh, I actually have a walkthrough in front of me in case I get uh, stuck this time. Uh, <laughs> which I will. I absolutely will because as we've established, I suck at these games. Starts uh, like uh, every other Japanese anime on a school building roof. <laughs> I'm assuming this is a school. Oh, oh. shit! You know, start like at 50% of every anime. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Pretty certain there was a hentai that started like that. Oh, no probably. And I've probably just outed myself there. <laughs> I'm pretty sure there was a hentai. Just... Oh, there was a hentai! So, in, in the autumn of 2013, apparently someone decided to bathe in jam in the middle of a school. <laughs> uh, uh, school playground. Um, that's uh, that's definitely what happened there. Mm -hmm. um, someone irreplaceable to me died. Oh, yeah. drowned in, drowned in jam. <laughs> Dr so, I'm trying to make this soft. All right. <laughs> so, how did Cortez conquer the Aztecs with a mirror? No, wait a minute. It's a man. Okay, um, right. <laughs> So, yeah, but... <laughs> just use that. <laughs> so, how did Cortez conquer the Aztecs with a mere 400 soldiers? Okay, I have no idea whether this is meant to be a male or a female. Yeah, you never know. So bored. <laughs> <laughs> okay, that's all for today. We'll start with the Inca Empire next time. God, he has a weirdly high-pitched voice, didn't he? You know, for 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 being like a uh, a balding Japanese <laughs> man in his fifties, uh, yeah, definitely. Uh, he's been going on the hormones lately. I think that's the problem. Uh, I don't know. Do you want to be blue hair girl here? Oh, Carrie, let's eat lunch. Perfect. <laughs> Done. Oh sure. I think it's a girl. Isn't it? Probably a girl. <laughs> yeah. I think there is a valley in between. Her. You seem kind of down, Carrie. Does that matter? I'm kind of bored lately. Nothing too interesting <laughs> happening. Come on, look. <laughs> but the, I know, well, I'm just... well I, look, I wasn't. I wasn't looking at her breasts. You, uh, yo, you were you looking. Have to at... investigate after all. You're like, you got to a girl. You got to, in, uh, yeah. You got to investigate the uh, the teenage girl's cleavage yeah, naturally. Yeah. Yes, but his drawings first, so it's fine. <laughs> It's a drawing, well, so it's okay. Again, you can get Jill for that. And she's 900 years old, so fuck you. <laughs> I, don't know about, I don't know about boring, but the school has kind of calmed down, hasn't it? It was super noisy for a while there. Yeah, already been a month since Shiori Natsumi died, eh? Hey. <laughs> yep, yeah, I'm, I'm sticking with it. Oh, boy. I'm sticking with it. That's so strange, isn't it? I think the most popular girl in school who had it all from looks to grades to money would kill herself. Yeah, well, you know, um, uh, those things don't necessarily make for a happy life. Mm. You know, have you thought about that? As president of Cosmos' Academy's newspaper club. Oh, God, she's the fake news. <laughs> God damn it. Of course, I should have known by the blue hair. <laughs> oh, yeah. Good luck out there. Hang on. You aren't going to help me? No. I'm going on my hormone replacement with the teacher. <laughs> the teacher. <laughs> Both of them are on hormones. <laughs> Why should I have to? As a fellow newspaper club member? Huh? Don't recall ever joining a shady joint like that. No, he's calling them out. Oh, well, the, the, it's calling them out for being fake. Yeah, they are pretty shady, to be fair. Besides, it's just an association and not a proper club, right? Can't get approved as a club unless you got three members. Same difference. You're always hanging around in the club room eating snacks, I carry, while I'm frantically writing articles. If you're gonna help, I'll tell you to our homeroom teacher. <laughs> Miss Abe's bothering me on club time. I think that's Abby. 
Oh, Masabi. Yeah. Like Masabi! Our, like our man Shinzo Abe. <laughs> Rest in peace. Have sex. I don't know. Have sex. Have sex. <laughs> have a sex. Have sex. <laughs> Anyways. <so. laughs> I love, I, sorry, I love that was it like that guy, like that Japanese guy reacting. You know? Yeah, it's like there appears to be memes of Shinzo Abe <laughs> around in Western Twitter uh, uh, say, uh, with him saying, have sex. <laughs> <laughs> Just not as big a thing. Like, yeah, they don't get, <laughs> like, what? It's, what are these weird guys are doing? <laughs> it says he's the basketball club advisor. What is it, this face? I don't know what's going on here. You've lost your eyes and they've been replaced with lines. <laughs> or it's it, actually it kind of looks like a it, it kind of looks like a caricature of an Asian person from yeah. an like an old cartoon from the forties. Oh, like a Bugs Bunny, yeah. But, um... Yeah. Well, of course, I come up with the horrible thing. <laughs> well, well, they did. That's what what's what I do. <laughs> and, si and since he's the basketball club advisor. You might pay you a little visit, like join basketball if you're so bored. Hey, hey, hey. Damn, that's dirty. Some journalist for justice you are. <laughs> you call for justice, God's sake. If you don't like it, then help me. That's my special kind of... <laughs> I'm sounding more spe Yeah, I'm sounding pretty special right now. But it's my special correspondent. That's one way to say do my chores. It's negative Nelly. <laughs> yeah, I think it's a girl. That's a mini skirt. <laughs> yeah, that's a skirt. <laughs> I'm sticking with the voice. I don't care. <laughs> hey, Bottles. We decided we're going to look into the Natsumi incident. You'll help too, right? I told you to stop calling me Bottles. Bottles. It's really demeaning. <laughs> Banjo, Banjo Kazooie back. Yeah? That's. Oh my god. It, holy shit, it's. um. Ah, uh, it's Doctor Insano. Holy shit! Do you think Do you think Uri watched Spoonie? Ah, <laughs> huh? not Sumi. That was suicide, right? <laughs> oh no, that's the bad word. We can't say the suicide word. That's unaliving, right? <laughs> uh, that's what I want to look into. It's just strange for such a blooded girl to kill herself, isn't it? Well, I don't know much about Natsumi. Probably just had some worries eating away at her. God, you're too good at that. <laughs> but, uh... That's the same thing Akari said. Well, look, even if it was suicide, I was thinking, why not figure out what exactly those worries were? You'll help us write bottles. You're technically the advisor for the Newspaper Association. A real bandwagon, aren't you? <laughs> I've got no way to assist you. Don't want to get yelled at for talking around either. Let's begin our investigation. I'm not even sure. We? I'm not even sure what he said there. Did, did he? Did he accept, or did mm. he, or did he just go, piss off, blue-haired girl? <laughs> You're the fake news. Right. So we've got ourselves a conga line going, and uh, I think I've got to talk to Bottles. Hey, Bottles, take off your glasses. It would be very painful. <laughs> Why? It's that thing, right? If you take off their glasses, they're actually hot. You know. <laughs> look, that's I think really, you'll... yeah, and hot in movies, yes. <laughs> look, I think you'll find I'm hot with or without my glasses. <laughs> Thank you very much, blue haired journalist. <laughs> what the fuck happened to your eyes? Why does he have sideways testicles for eyes? Like fish lips. <laughs> Oh god. It's, it's always that kind of, that's kind of like how they draw lips. Yeah, and he's got the little fish lips boy, thing. Boy, boy, yeah. and they go boy. Well, am I hot? Sorry, I mean, you know, it's just eyes, maybe. It is kind of weird, though. I mean, yeah. I'm sorry. Yeah, uh, see, you, f you fucked up everything. Now he's probably gonna kill himself. He's named him. after the mole from, the, the nerd mole from Banjo Kazooie. Oh, it's a Ben Yeah, I don't think it's a rat, right? It's a rat, right? It's bottles. <laughs> it's fine. <laughs> Poor old Dr. Insano. Is there stuff to look at in here? Look at all these multicolored books. That's on the notice board. It's a trash can. Anyways, um, what, what was that? Anyways, it's now available on the cell phone menu. 
Because <laughs> we've got a cell phone. <laughs> oh, no. that. Yeah. Hot apps. We are play we are playing as a teenage girl after all. Our entire world is our cell phone. Um, to do is try asking bottles. But I've already I've already completely ruined his self esteem for the day. Owie owie! Owie, owie. Uh, newspaper associate, a curious, vigorous fad follower. <laughs> so she's an NPC, basically. <laughs> Can be susceptible to panic at times. Belongs to the newspaper association, but it's only her. <laughs> Wait, so it is just her then. Uh, thus, it's not an official club, but she insists it's a newspaper club. Accepted to Cosmos Academy in senior high. Has known Akari since her first year. They get on uh, well, so they're always hanging out. Uh, Akari Abe. <laughs> the daughter of Shinzo Abe. Poorly depressed after her fucking chat of a father was murdered by some crazy person who definitely was not being funded by the CIA. Uh, <laughs> common did, they, did they have a control, a, a control over like Japan or anything? Oh, I don't know. <laughs> I just like to claim that things are being done by the CIA. Yeah. Because about, I would say about seven times out of ten I'm probably correct. <laughs> you know, it's what Alex Jones does. He just kind of <laughs> he just kind of claims that the CIA did it, and uh, most of the time he is correct, you know. <laughs> and everyone forgets the times he's not. Mukoda Kunihiko, aka Doctor Insano, he wears Coke bottle glasses, so Aoi and Akari call him Bottles. So they're making fun of him for his glasses. Good lord, not a hot guy even if you take off his glasses. It seems all right. I mean, I'm not gay or anything, Value but, you know, I mean, I'm, I'm not gay or anything, but, you know, 20 bucks is 20 bucks. <laughs> 20 <laughs> <laughs> Like, you know, he gives me, f okay, he gives me 50 bucks, you know, maybe. <laughs> Shiori Natsume, uh, uh, who uh, likes to bathe in jam out in the, uh, in the school grounds, you know. Uh, the attractive and clear-headed star of Cosmos Academy. Daughter of the president of Natsumi Corporation, a prominent business in the prefecture, died one month ago by falling off the roof of the school. That's yes, her, and that's her police uh, sketch on the, the ground. Yeah, there we go. That's <laughs> <laughs> they used purple chalk to purple. outline her on the ground. Hey, do you know anything, bottles? Do you know fucking anything, balls? Yeah, you're not, you're Is there anything in that empty fucking brain of yours? You got no looks. <laughs> you got no looks. You got no looks. So you you should have personality, right? Go talk to Fujimura in the staff room. Okay, I like this. There's a bit. Of, there's a bit of direction. You know, this is. Uh, what the fuck is this? <laughs> well, it's a little map or something. It looks like they're in a really long bed together. <laughs> um, <laughs> they're teenage girls. They're teenage girls. Uh, yeah, you could. Just come from confirmation of just age. <laughs> it's yeah. Make our old thing. yeah. So like, I mean, if they're seventeen, then it's like, well. <laughs> Anyways, you can, you can move. Like, I've already declared I'm gay for Doctor Insano. I mean, we got. <laughs> it's floating. There's a fucking. There, there are fucking that weird Indonesian uh, demon. The uh, the thing that you know that the head comes off and their guts are hanging down and they just fly around drinking people's. No, don't they like eat fetuses out of yeah, out yeah, of yeah, women's cooches? Yeah. yeah. Yeah, they just kind of go up to the cooch and just be like. <laughs> the penagla. Yeah, I, I never could um, pronounce it. Oh shit. Oh, well, right, so we're at the staff room now, so we gotta go there. Okay, so I can't. I can't go into the staff room. Why can't I go into the staff room? Can I just go in here? Okay then, I guess we'll just go listen to people talking. You're IT! You're IT! Doing clock work? Keep at it! <laughs> 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 Who knows? <laughs> Some this, character. She's a chipmunk in a human, uh, in a human skin. It's a trash can, right? Okay, so um, what's it? Oh, I can't go in there. Can't go in there. Can't go in the gym. Can't go in the pool. I can't go anywhere. Field. Tennis court. One A. Courtyard. Oh, we're in the courtyard. Yeah, this is very, it's kind of jazzy, kind of, 
do. It's like what these schools like. It was like walking, walking, yeah, here. Just walking around with a bit of jazz in the background. Mm-hmm. Absolutely no conflict whatsoever. Yeah, Everyone just loved each other. Yeah. I can't go with the staff room, even though I'm supposed to. Oh, go talk to Fujimura, uh, Fujimura in the staff room. Well, I'm at the staff room, but they're not letting me go in the staff room. Mm-hmm. What is going on there? What are they hiding? We'll find out next time on Dragon Ball Z. We're in the ca- cafeteria now. Is there anyone to talk to in here? Check out this cafeteria. Holy shit. Oh, we got a vending machine. This is going to be the gruff dinner lady. Ah, it's Oi. Did you come by for a snack? Ah. Okay, okay, um, uh, Ashley just messaged me and called me a cunt. <laughs> that would be pretty normal. I think, um, uh, no, she just, she's just done it out of the blue. I haven't said anything to her. Oh, I think she might, I think it might be because, oh, she, she sent me a bunch of photos of her at Comic-Con, and I haven't said anything about it. I didn't go and look at them, like, yeah, she just sent me a laughing emoji. <laughs> Fuck you, bitch. <laughs> Fuck you. No! Oh. Come get a treat later. You know what? This fucking lunch lady is dedicated to you, Ashy. <laughs> this is what you sound like. Oh, come get a treat later then. I'm single and surrounded by cats. Oh, Anyways. <laughs> we all love you here. We do. This is done out of love. What the fuck is going on here? Why can't I go anywhere? I can go off into the void. <laughs> I can. Wh- I don't know where the fuck I am. I'm just like. Aah! What's everyone doing here? Is this some kind of cult initiation? <laughs> yes. What the fuck is happening here? Day, just... I can't get anyone near these people. No. This one. I fell asleep in the living room yesterday, and my sister took a pic of me sleeping. Hope she doesn't post that online. No, she'll do it. Oh, she'll do it. Your sister sounds like a bitch, to be honest. Um, she sounds like um, Nabiki in Ranma One Half. Yeah. So remember, she takes photos of uh, of Ranma. Yeah, but she did it for like financial gain. This girl does it for. <laughs> yeah, and as we all know, financial. Uh, if you do something for financial gain, it's entirely moral. It's not entirely moral. <laughs> <laughs> it's, it's, it's not even moral. Dude, I'm just saying. Dude, I'm <laughs> a. Necessarily. I'm a capitalist through and through. Any uh, as long as it is a. <laughs> Why is as it moral? It, as long it's as it is a, a voluntary it, transaction, it's I don't care. A good financial investment. That, that's the way you go. Look at it. <laughs> well, pictures of Ranma, certainly. Yeah. <laughs> Depends on what Ranma. Well, female Ranma. We all know Ranma is best girl. Oh, oh, what's this? Who's this guy? Oh, I'll be here. Eh, oh, it's a. Eh, you need something. Wait, this is Fujimura. Yeah, where is he? Wait, why isn't he in the staff room? He's lying to us. Is this not the? St- I thought the staff room was. It looks like a staff room. Right? It does look like a staff room. Yeah. The greyest and all. <laughs> this is where we all go. This is like the interface for computer for the night. This place used to be much more colorful, but then we all started smoking because y'all are assholes. <laughs> Cause, y'all are- <laughs> Cause y'all are assholes. Yeah. Mm-hmm. You y'all. Need, you need someone? Mr. Fujimura, you were the first one to see Hugh at Simi's corpse, right? <laughs> Just walk up and ask about that. It's like, are you traumatized? <laughs> Live long. They're like old coot, don't they? <laughs> old coot. It's like an old coot. No one, <laughs> no one says that anymore. But they, they, they love that. Party dialogue. The the person who, um, the, the person who translates this loves old coot. <laughs> can I look in? I can't actually. I don't think I can explore any of these things in this game. I can't do that. I've got to do it myself. It's a trash can. Oh. Oh no, what happened here? Alright, so we can go to the site of Natsume's death. <laughs> How long are you gonna lie there pretending to be a corpse? <laughs> Bright colored golf girl. <laughs> I'm pretting myself in Natsumi's shoes. Don't disturb me. Yeah, well, she, she will have been. Up. She will have been entirely unconscious by this point. Like I don't know. It probably would have been better if you went to the roof. You're not doing good enough. You're unconscious yet. <laughs> I'll fucking knock you out. I'll knock you out. Just before Natsumi died here, what was she being thinking? What? what 
Was was she feeling? Was was she feeling? Was was. <laughs> was, was. Tis was. Tis was is. Um. <laughs> Meditating there, dumbass. No point in thinking about how the dead feel. God, that's a goth thing to say, isn't it? Well, do you have anything to carry? Do you? <laughs> do you? Nope. Just confirm what I already knew. Here's an article from the web. It's about Natsume. Oh, for real? What to say? Early in the 20th at Cosmos Girls Academy in Miyari, Towaki to Prefecture, student Shiori Natsume was found dead by staff. Natsume's body suffered massive trauma and was confirmed dead at the hospital. Prefecture police are investigating suspecting, a, uh, investigating, suspecting a fall from the rooftop. So yeah, that's basically it. Uh, about all we can say with certainty right now is that there uh, is here in this article. Oh, so there's an article. Guess there would have to be a source of suicide on the live rumors or spreading <laughs> on the live rumors. No, it, it, so you didn't know there was an article. What kind of fucking journalist are you? Yeah. The principal talked with the cops, yeah, according to Bottles. All right! Then let's get moving and try talking with the principal! All right! All right. Yeah. <laughs> so it's a janitor's room. Oh, wait a second. Didn't it say the staff room? Yeah. Hold on. Would you were in the staff room? Game fucking game's back. fucking game is lying to me. So the staff room is still off limits. Oh, we got the principals off. Check this guy out. Mm. <laughs> the most lavish place in the entire building. <laughs> Mr. Principal, you have a second? <laughs> I told you, you stupid girl. My name is. <laughs> Yes! What is it? Oh, I guess, I guess he doesn't have a name. He's just Principal Senior I High Headmaster. I am Principal headmaster. Senior High Headmaster! Fuck you! <laughs> principal <laughs> Principal Bracket Senior he High Headmaster Esquire. Esquire. <laughs> Do you have anything like a police report about Shiro Natsumi's death? I'd like to ask about it. Uh, yar. <laughs> he's, he's fucking, uh, what's his name? Uh... Is it Alistair Sim from Christmas Carol? You Scrooge. <laughs> what are you doing? I am I am Oe from Class Two A. There are entirely too many vowels in that oh. name, young lady. Oe. Wolf howl over there. Right, I went Mr. Owl. He's like mocking her. Miss Owl. I've got to get my things ready for a meeting. I have you leave. And will you talk with me once your meeting's over? No, oh, no, there's nothing to tell you. Go on, up with you. I'm a meeting with the teachers of four. Ah, my prostate is ass up. Ah. There's got to be one character that like, kills my voice or something. Yeah, yeah, this is the one. It wasn't, uh... Hey, don't go... <laughs> hey, don't go there and put my shovel down for top. I'll do oh, I'll, oh, I'll do oh, I like you dying old coot. Old coot. <laughs> I'm gonna look at other stuff because it, it's, look at, yeah, I'm just gonna look at all your stuff. Fuck you, old man. Fuck the system. <laughs> Fuck the system. <laughs> Fuck the principal. Fuck the system. Fuck the system. I carry stuff. Okay, so he said. Oh, we're, we've got a hallway now. Oh, what the heck? Come on, you can tell me. That obviously wasn't gonna work. Even a teacher like Bottles didn't hear any details. Wait, is Bottles a teacher? You, were, you, were you gonna call your... So your teacher was like... Yeah, come to see what you look like. I wanna see what you look like. I wanna see if you're hot, Mr. <laughs> teacher, who's clearly older than me. And he's just acting like with fucking, like, tech nerd, like, Oh, God! You're always getting me to do things because you got tits. Which <laughs> <laughs> is almost that quick, like, the thing I got. You know, it's just like, oh no. Quite clearly, yes. Um, but sure, I'd like to see the findings of a rational investigation. Maybe we could fish around the office while he's out of his meeting. Yeah, good. Only caught a glimpse, but the shelves and stuff all seem locked. Even if there are papers in there, how are you going to open them? Yeah, true. What to do? Guess we should take a step back and work on a plan. We got to make a plan. Plan! <laughs> Dental plan! Right, so I think we've got to go and speak to Bottles. Oh, I'm at the, oh this is the infirmary. That's another person who looks very much like the um, uh, the dinner lady. Do you need something? 
Are you feeling unwell? <laughs> no, I'm bursting with energy. You're bursting with something. My, that's good to hear. The girls who aren't well might come visit, so please just come again when you need me. They are sisters, I've decided. Where the fuck is Balls? He's not here. Oh, he's a social studies guy, I forgot. I just thought, because he's Dr. Insano, I thought he would be in one of the science rooms because I'm a tard. Um, hey, Balls! The principal wouldn't tell us anything! Yeah, no duh. Abby, you really need to do uh, need uh, do need to keep Oh in, in here in check. Don't treat me like her guardian, okay? Anyway, bottles. I hear you've got a meeting at four. Whoops. Yeah, I sure do. That's in thirty minutes. Maybe I'll get some tea from the store first. Take it you'll be talking about Natsume at that meeting too. Hmm. Well. Sure, I do get regular reports, still don't know any details, and it's nothing I can do anything about. Alright, I'm going to the store. Don't get up to anything weird, you! Like kissing each other or anything like that. You wouldn't want to be accidentally filmed by one of these cameras that I've set up around here, allegedly. <laughs> There's like a five second silence in it of them just looking directly at each other, and then he just walks out of the room. What to do? Let's hurry, Aoi. Well, what to do? We would be worried for what he just said last. What was that he just said? <laughs> I can't retain memory. I think we should start <laughs> kissing. <laughs> for some reason, I, swear, I think. <laughs> <laughs> oh, God. All right. I better get things in order. Oh, no. What's the matter? There's a weirdo at the gate. He might be up to something. Please hold on. I'll be right there. This This could be a distraction, actually. So it might be one of the, the two girls out there shouting. <gasps> right. Ah, oh, man. All right, let's find that police report. There will be me, so I'll just start feeling around. <laughs> <laughs> well, what were you thinking there? Uh, same, and, same as you. <laughs> oh, but a carry did tell me to check on top of her de of the desk and to take care of it in three minutes. Here goes. Okay. Oh shit! I've actually got time here. Wait. Read it quickly. <laughs> All these papers for readings. Parents in guardian reading report. Prepare for terms of exams. Oh shit! Right. I say for the documents in here. Oh, I don't have a fuck. What? <laughs> What's this? Hey, everyone, good luck. Okay, what about these fire? Have you those four doors that are all locked? A bunch of documents that we're going to stay tight? What about that door? The fucking door! Do you have a teacher find me? I have to be quiet. Okay, so I. Can I jump out the window? No! <laughs> Damn it! Can I pause this? No, I can't! Oh, it just no. keeps going! What the fuck was that? I don't know what the fuck that was! I'm not seeing anything here. Oh no. What about the shelf? Nothing on the shelf. Uh, what, what is this? Oh, it's a key! It's a key! It's a fucking key! It's a key, it's a fucking key. Use the key! And what about it? So it's not the key to this? What about the fucking filing cabinet? Oh, no, let me. Yep. But, oh god, it's the individual drawers! Oh no, I checked the third one instead of the second one. Oh! 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 It's the third one! Not to keep her out of her loose board and definitely she already got to me. This is it! I don't know what you said. Um. Oh, okay. There we go. Man, that was... That was something. That was that was intense. Sorry. I thought it was a creepy stranger. But it was Dr. Insano. <laughs> Why, you! <laughs> Mr. Makoto, we'll have your meeting soon. Where are you about to go? Uh, uh, to buy some tea at the store. Could you just get some for the vending machines on campus? Ah, uh, well, uh, I, I wanted to go for a walk, uh, for a change of pace. You'll be bumbling around off campus while you're on the job. Not to mention the slobbery appearance of yours making you be mistaken for a stranger. Unbelievable. Just don't be late for the meeting. God, this guy's getting it from all ends, isn't he? Poor dude. 
Why am I getting chewed out? What did I do? My bad, Bottles. You're a real help. Face. I know that face. She's got the foot biting the bottom lip there. <laughs> She's got it for bottles. <laughs> She's got it for Doctor and Sue. But she likes mistreating him. That, that's just like... Oh god, that's the... Th yeah. <laughs> it's not always the way. It is. Hey! I found the police press investigation for the two pigs! Huh? What are you two doing? How'd you find it that quickly? I mean, you told us you'd be talking about Natsumi at the meeting, which meant he'd need to have that prepare... The, have prepared documents for that. Listen! Don't use me like this again! Okay. Well, we'll remember that. Okay. Well. <laughs> the fucking... Montage music video that you made. <laughs> the fucking, um, the, the fucking uh, Always Sunny in Philadelphia caption comes up. They use him again later. <laughs> Don't slander us. It's not like we asked you to do anything, did we, Bottles? That way you play dumb. You didn't do anything, Bottles. Great, huh? You little devils. <laughs> this is gonna like chase after him. <laughs> oh, you little devils! <laughs> oh, he's gonna get us! <laughs> fucking dude's chasing them around. <laughs> <laughs> like fucking like some old playboy yeah. who can get like young, young hot women to go see. He goes, oh, <laughs> I have money! He doesn't have it. <laughs> <laughs> okay, let's read these materials we got. Uh, at 6.40 a.m. on 9.20, Shozo Fujimura, janitor at Cosmos Girls Academy, in doing rounds of the school, discovered a second, second year student, Shiori Natsumi, lying face up to the side of the tennis court. After checking the victim's pulse and calling to her to no response, he contacted the police and hospital, as well as the school's senior high headmaster, Shigeharu Chida. Alright, so the, so the principal's name is Shigeharu Chida, so he actually has a name then. He's not just Mr. Principal, brackets, headmaster of the school. Yeah. Cause of death, heavy trauma after falling from roof. Estimated time of death between 11pm and 12am on uh, 919. Clothing at time of discovery, black cardigan, white blouse, pink skirt, black tights, red pumps. Belongings on the scene, school bag, wallet, commuter pass, star smartphone, handkerchief, tissues, cosmetic pouch pencil box. Smartphone retained social media exchanges with family, fellow students and others, but no references were found to an explanation for Natsumi's trespass onto the rooftop. The door to the rooftop was busted and locked the whole time. Seems that way. You're so sure you couldn't get up there. This would mean you actually could since a few months ago. Oh right, let's even go there or not. Well, we checked earlier. No, just... Checked earlier, but you didn't no, do anything. Does. You just kind of sat, uh, you just kind of stood there and stared at it. This looks like Neapolitan ice cream. <laughs> <laughs> well, I remember that. I remember that shit. Yeah, only liking some of it. Yeah, I, I, yeah, I only ever ate the vanilla. Mm -hmm. Oh no, neurotic girl crying in a corridor. Yeah. Oh no, that girl. She seemed kind of familiar. Someone from 2D, I think? No need to go and run off. Guess she was crying in secret. Maybe so. Hmm, sure enough, it's locked tight. Guess they fixed the broken door after the incident, eh? I'd like to get locked up to the rooftop. Who, hey, who'd you be in charge of the key to this door? I got no idea. Oh well. We've learned the gist of this case, so let's call today's investigations here. I'm optimistic. I'm going to. I'm dreaming death. <laughs> you all, you realize, Owe, that you're just uh, uh, distracting yourself from the looming darkness <laughs> of the grave. So what are we getting up to today? I'd be thinking about it, and I definitely want to investigate the rooftop where the incident happened. Yeah, we tried doing that yesterday, Wu. <laughs> you have the memory span of a fucking goldfish. <laughs> so today, I think I'd like to go find some way to go to the roof. Yeah, yeah, we yeah, know well, that. We, we, we tried that earlier. Uh, what? So, so nothing's happening yet. We've got to figure out the entire day of how to get the key, and then tomorrow is the day we go up the roof. What? You gonna bust down the door? Surely not. I imagine one of the teachers or Mr. Fujimura is in charge of the roof key. Let's check that first. Alright. 
Let's go speak to Balls. So we can degrade him more. Hey, Balls! I think I was in charge of the key to the rooftop! What? <laughs> oh, shut up! I hate you guys. <laughs> I'm a teacher. <laughs> he's a, he's got yeah he's got short fuse. He hasn't he's not putting up with the shit anymore. Yeah, he's a teacher. <laughs> he's just getting like manipulated by. I'm not gonna say anymore. But... <laughs> I mean, this is weird. By cause... jailbait. He's, yeah. getting, <laughs> he's getting manipulated by jailbait. Yeah. He, he, he's still mad. Come on, you're always getting scoldings from the principal. You must be used to it, right? Huh. <laughs> <laughs> There's nothing to say. <laughs> Sorry, bottles. I'll be sure not to get you involved again. You know how Aoi doesn't listen to what anyone says, right? She might go do something rash again if we leave her be. Won't you help for my sake, as the one who looks after her? As the one who craves death? I'll keep her from bothering you again, Bottles. What I'm about to say is just me talking to myself. Whoever might happen to overhear, it's got nothing to do with me. The keys to unused rooms are rotated between each he grade head teachers. This month, I think it was the second year's life coach and head teacher. Head teacher? Life coach? Who's that again? Guy Kageyama, damn it! You guys' is homeroom teacher! Ah, oh, that was it. Thanks, Bones. <laughs> God, he's in such a bad mood. <laughs> Oh, what's this? Got a figure. Is there anyone in here? Other than... Oh no! Alright, never mind. Oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> oh, we can go in the staff room now. Or can we? Hold your horses, Aoi. Are you planning to just blindly charge at Kageyama? Uh, I mean, yes! You don't think being like, I want to go to the rooftop, please lend me a key, is actually going to work, do you? Especially after someone fell and died. Mr. Kageyama, <laughs> I wanted to talk for a bit, is that okay? Huh, what is it? <laughs> oh, oh yeah, he's the, yeah, it's that guy. Uh, it's a little bit, uh, I don't really want people to overhear, so could you come out of the hallway? Surely the hallway would be more public. Come on, Akari. All right, here it goes. I'll stick over to Kageyama's desk and nap the key to the rooftop. Top, yeah. Top, top, top. And not get, and not get uh, yeah, it's in her head, yeah. <laughs> and, not, and not get caught by any of the... <laughs> we distracted one teacher. There are multiple lovers. Oh, wait, no, so, so you're... So you're crouching down. Beware of scary teacher. Oh, he's gonna... He might see me, though. <gasps> Did you drop something? Should I look for you? Should I look for you? Let's find out here. Don't consider yourself. Can I just keep going? No. Ah! Oh no! The game, the story suddenly turned into a violent hentai, and the game is over. Right. So this is a stealth segment. Um. So what would this? Hey! Why are you stepping on my bar? Sorry. Excuse me. All right. Okay. So how do I? Oh no! Right, so this keeps happening. Um, I'm really bad at this. Um, okay, so I can't go up that way. What if I went up this? Way? No, no, I can't because that's a scary teacher. What about the non-scary teacher? Can I go? <gasps> nope. What's that? What's Nothing. Okay, what's the difference between the scary teachers and the non-scary teachers then? Uh -huh. I do not understand. I don't uh, understand. <laughs> I might be able to go up this way. No! Oh, fuck. Oh, wait, so do I keep going up that way? So yeah, like the, the, the scary teachers and the non-scary teachers have no... Have no real difference. They, they, either way, they still chuck me out. That guy, can that guy see me? Like, apparently, that guy can't see me. Can that guy see me? There's a person that really. Okay, well, there we go. I guess we're. Just like, haha, I'll, I'll take everything. This guy. 
fucking idiot. <laughs> Look at him. He just doesn't give a shit. He's too busy walking from. He's too busy watching violent hentai on yeah, his yeah, school yeah. computer. Oh no! Oh no! Oh shit! Oh no! <laughs> what are you doing? What are you doing? What are you holding? <laughs> 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 I like the music. I know. <laughs> With little head. Alright, got it. What if we go down this way? Oh, no! I got caught! Fuck! Do I go behind that guy? Oh, no, but, but, but that guy would just... That guy would just notice me if I went right behind him, though. How does this work? Right, so I know what to do now. <laughs> this is the most laid-back stealth sequence. <laughs> okay, so... Right, so... Fucking Kagayama comes back. Right, so I just go down here, I think. And that guy turns and, uh, and, and talks on his phone, you see? And then I leave. Aha! Fucking, no sense of all of you. fucking solid snake eat your heart out. I didn't even need a cardboard box or anything. <laughs> you just need, uh, I, I don't know whatever the hell that was. But, uh, <laughs> <laughs> need that someone... I, need, I need jazzy music <laughs> to sort of just people, vibe and to. And people like, who just have these kind of sprites and just turn. And then <laughs> look at other and They just have no concept of the world. Like, it's like... <laughs> no peripheral vision. <laughs> I was sweating there. I didn't I was able to get it okay. So, when are you going to use that exactly? Well, why not right now? Could be fine, but there's lots of classrooms being used by clubs on the way to the rooftop. The art room, the music room. If we're seen going onto the roof, things are going to get real annoying. Would we? Uh, it would be better to go sometime when there's nobody watching. I don't think anyone would give a shit. <laughs> Grand night type stratagem. We'll go home and infiltrate at night. A little too bold, don't you think? If you want to go at night, you could just not go home and hide somewhere. I like how I like how Akari is kind of enabling her, even though she kind of looks like she's she's a bit like annoyed by this whole thing. It's like, oh god, well why don't you do this? Help I'm helping you with your <laughs> with your crazy schemes, even though I'm clearly irritated by them. This is a bathroom. There probably would not be any uh, windows there, hopefully, so Haposai doesn't get in and steal knickers. Oh, what's this? What's going on out here? It's some kind of party going on. Hey, I just be bothering them. Steal their fucking boombox. <laughs> steal it or change it, so, it in the fucking thing. so they're playing Tony Martin era Black Sabbath. <laughs> What the headless cross! <laughs> da, da, they all just start headbanging. Da, 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 da. Oh, gym. Ooh, the gym. Oh, a guy! Ah, here we go. First floor, small window. Place that be used for clubs today. Could this be it? Bingo. You know, this does seem easy to get in. Small low windows, so people might only notice if this one one's unlocked. Can't say that for certain, though. How about a little like, something extra to make doubly sure? <laughs> what would that mean? I'll save the details for later, but how would you go about making sure this gym doesn't get used? That no one goes inside? <laughs> traffic cones. Everybody knows traffic cones are impenetrable. <laughs> what about this? Ah, yes, there we go. Maybe place the high jump mat in front of the door? Hmm, it's too heavy for two of us to move it. Okay, so did. Okay. All right, boys, teacher slave. God. Yeah, we just gotta go get. Um, oh, what's this? What about this rake? Okay, perfect. That's it. It's a single sliding door, so this prevents it being open from outside. So this will stop anyone from checking. Wouldn't they find it strange if they came to check the gym and the door would be open? And what if there was a reason they didn't have to check it, and didn't have to go inside? Would they try to pry it open then? Okay, time for a review. 
who does patrols around the school. Would that be Fujimura, the guy that found the, uh, uh, the unfortunate girl swimming in jam? So that would be at the janitor's office, surely. Sup, bro? Oh, it's some little Mr. Detective. Need something? Um, you see, it's about the gym. Our class had PE in the gym for six period, and since no clubs planned to use it today, the teacher locked it after class. He also locked the windows, so you shouldn't have to do your rounds today or tomorrow morning. We were told to let you know, Mr. Fujimura. Yeah, I'm just gonna believe you then! Oh, is that right? Well, thanks for going out your way. I appreciate the time saver. Yeah, this doesn't seem irregular in any way, shape, or form. I like it, Mr. Fujimura. You always seem so nice. I feel kind of guilty. So you should. It's not a huge lie. It's fine. If you don't like it, why not give up, Miss Trespasser? <laughs> I'll do it, I'll do it. All right, so I'll read up and try the gate at night tonight. <laughs> Look at her. <laughs> Look at her. <laughs> it's like cartoons. You mock the art of infiltration? What's with that get up? <laughs> this is like, it starts off with such a morbid, like, image. That girl just splatted on the ground, and we end up with this ridiculous nonsense, which I'm enjoying, don't get me wrong. But... Did you come from home wearing that? <laughs> no, I just changed here earlier. You just changed in the middle of, okay. On a track suit, it just didn't fit the mood, and after I nailed it perfectly. Now hold on, this isn't the final form. Give me a sec. This isn't even my final form. Wow. <laughs> this looks like fucking. Looks like the killer from Prom Night. <laughs> Listen to the music. It's it sounded it sounded like the Pink Panther yeah. theme. Is that do 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 do? Oh, it's open, it's open. Mr. Fujimura is so open, so honest. Alright, so let's get the limited mission again. Yeah, we've taken advantage shop. of this old man's trusting nature. <laughs> nope. Um, I can't read, really, it only really occurred to me, but I'm actually not good with ghosts and stuff. Well, who said well, anything about fine. ghosts? This is not There's <laughs> no fucking ghosts in this place, as far as anyone can tell. Let's get going already. Follow me. <laughs> it's that fucking mask. <laughs> Alright, we get to... Oh! Oh! What's this? Oh, cards. We've got health. So what's going on here? Oh, oh, oh. Hey, Oh, uh, sorry. It's kind of dusty. Oh, wait, what? So I sneezed and that hurt her. Hmm. God, she is a journalist. Just totally thin skin. <laughs> Alright, here we are. What fucked up shit is gonna happen? Is there gonna be a total tone change? I don't know. Like Freemason Cabalist, something like that. Yeah. Or, or a. Sacrificing a, or, a dead cow. Filming a violent hentai. <laughs> violent. Ah, and the stars have uh, have appeared. <laughs> oh no! The stars are alive. Oh no! Oh, no. Uh, I can see where Natsumi's body was, so she fell from here down to there. It hurts even imagining it. Oh, Amitabha. Amitabha. What is that? Is she... That's like a Buddhist thing. Oh, is that a Buddhist thing? Amitabha. Right, yeah. yeah. Hey, Aoi. Uh, what? Why are you so invested in Natsumi's death? You weren't friends or anything, right? That's what I was thinking. I told you, didn't I? just didn't sit right with me. Sure, I wasn't friends with Natsumi, but she was the school's idol, you know. Pretty, rich, smart, everyone looked up to her. If a girl like that came to loaf life and choose death, it kind of makes me wonder what might happen to me. It's all about me, me. don't you see? It's me! Seriously. <laughs> it's kind of like if a lower middle class girl like me with no redeeming qualities like me is still alive, why did you kill yourself? No redeeming qualities. Maybe sub <laughs> what? <laughs> Maybe subconsciously I did feel some aspiration towards Natsumi. Believe it or not, I was pretty shocked. So I want to know why she died, you know. I it was really suicide. I don't know why. Or not, as it stands. <laughs> it just doesn't make any sense. It doesn't matter at this point. <laughs> 
In other words, you're thinking it's inconceivable a person as blessed uh, as Natsumi would kill herself. I like to think that, yes. Hmm. So, by the way, I'm gonna die now. Wait, okay, well... Okay, so that wasn't that wasn't a joke we just added in there about her being a goth and everything. Uh, she just right. said that. So what the fuck is going to happen? Um. Whoa, whoa, whoa. What? What? What are you doing? What's going on? No. I'm gonna jump from here and die. Wait, no. Is she doing like a sort of? Uh, is she like doing putting on some kind of show for some reason? What, am I, what are you talking about? That's dangerous. Stop, seriously. Say I were to do something like that and kill myself, would you know why I did it? Oh, no, not a chance. I'm sure people around me would go, she didn't seem like the kind to kill herself. Well, but then maybe there, there was something troubling her. No one could possibly understand the depths of another's mind. Just going in for a peek isn't enough to allow for perfect comprehension. In the end, you just have to be satisfied slotting in whatever reality suits you. But that's not the real reality. You can't know the reality anyhow, and can't well search the heart of every single stranger. That's how you gotta think. Maybe Natsume died for a reason you won't find satisfaction with. Do you still want to investigate it, even if that might be the result? God, this is getting deep now. <laughs> Even if it means your idol falling off her pedestal ah. and crumbling. Oh, ah, ah, that's ah, what it means. Said, said the fucking, ah, ah. Do you know? Do you want to know the truth? I'm not entirely following, but basically you're saying that you're opposed to this investigation, Akari. Wrong. I might think it's futile, but you don't think so, do you, Aoi? In which case, I'll assist. I do like you and all, and I want to see you doing as you please. It's been boring lately, anyhow. That said, I've got no interest in the truth about Natsumi, so you'll have to take the lead. Okay, got it. Just leave it to me. Oh, okay, right. This side beats the tennis court. How is Natsumi found again? I should give it another check. Okay, so I just checked it. I guess that's all I had to do. Natsumi was in casual clothes, coming her back, fell from here, and I was like, face up. Huh, ah, is there something to say? Carrie, you think jumping up, right? If you jumped like that facing forward, you wouldn't, you wouldn't land face up, would you? That's true. Not unless you purposely face backward or happen to spin around in just the right way while falling. There's a possibility that she was pushed and fell, fell while facing this way. The idea she was leaning back on the fence, then slipped and fell, is hard to imagine with how low it is. Your idea might be more probable. But the police report didn't mention any signs of a struggle. If you were pushed from the front, you'd expect some resistance, yeah? I see. Mm. Ugh. Yeah. Ah. The bag. Her bag. The police report mentioned that Sumi's school bag was found where she landed, right? It's different for the roof to kill yourself while carrying a bag. Wouldn't that be strange? Also, school bags seem pretty heavy, can't they? If she was pushed while carrying it, maybe she'd have time to resist. Feeling like you're thinking solely in a direction that suits your hypothesis, but I'll admit uh, that it'd be strange if it were plain old self on alive. <laughs> I'm trying. Mm, I'm starting to see more and more possibilities of war and suicide. <laughs> so, what's up next? To get there and time to it, we don't know why Natsumi came to the roof at night in the first place. To settle that mystery and more, I think there's a need to know what kind of person Natsumi was. And also, was Natsumi really alone? If it wasn't suicide, when you consider the possibility someone was with her. To start tomorrow, I think we should establish who Natsumi was and who was connected to her. Which would mean lots of asking around. Natsumi's classmates, club friends, and her family, too. Alright, tomorrow we're gonna get fired up. Good morning, Mr. Kagiyama. Uh, morning. Uh, something you wanted to discuss again? No, not that. You're the basketball team advisor, yes? Did they have practice this morning? Right, right, they did. The gym was left unlocked, wasn't it? You knew about that? Mr. Fujimura asked me to tell you since I'm in your class. He forgot to lock it yesterday while patrolling and wanted to apologize. Oh, for fuck's sakes! That poor old dude. Oh, is that what happened? I was thinking I'd go tell Mr. Fujimura later. Thanks for being the messenger. Not a problem. 
Well then. Well, it's a good thing neither of them are going to confront each other on that, mm -hmm. assuming, assumedly. Huh? Mr. Kageyama, it looks like someone dropped something. Is this key yours? Oh, very clever. <laughs> ah, what's Doc doing there? He fell out when I was fishing through a drawer. Thanks for that, Tabby. I'd have been chewed out if I lost that. You should be careful. It'd be terrible if someone misused it. <laughs> There's that little smile. We're back at fucking Dr. Insano's office just bothering him. So that's how that went. Yeesh. At least think about the follow-up. Why'd I have to do it? Uh, I can be for going about giving the key back. That's my carry. Oh, for the plan. Thank you. Alright, then let's get to the questioning. Most likely a musical info would probably be girls in your grade. The girls in the same club as Natsumi. Let's try starting there. Okay, well, um, oh, we've got something to look at over there, but, uh, yeah, I think it's about time we, uh, uh, called this one a day, so, um, we'll find out what happens next time. Oh, uh, yeah, so we got the, the oh, we got interview mode. Check, change topics, da, da, da. okay, that's interesting. All right, uh, so anyways, we'll find out next time. I've been your host, uh, Ducky. And this has been a wonderful, sexy Mr. Christopher Beard. Let's see it. And may you ride the night to the morning sun.